All right, good morning, guys. It's a new day and a new video for you and a new adventure for us. Mm. Me and Kaylin just finished packing up the Jeep, and now we're going to head about 50 miles north and try to hit Ocala and do some of the trails out there. Uh, yeah. We've been wanting to do the trails. There's a, a bunch of sand tracks we kept seeing on the way out and in. Now we have an idea where they are. We're going to basically go down those sand tracks and check them all out and just do a bunch of four-wheeling. Yeah, and two-wheel drive, because my front drive shaft is still Ooh. on Henry's hood. Yes, it is. You know, I think there's going to be a recovery fee for this drive shaft. It's, it's been in shipping for days now. Uh, you got a tracking number? I don't. It's lost. It's gone. Mm -mm. I'm not even sure. I saw there. it just in a oh, rusting wait. on your hood. Yeah, it's still there. We're good. We're good. All right, so we're going to head out. We'll see you guys out there. All right, so uh, since we're gonna go hit some trails, we decided that on a nice warm asphalt, it'd be better than the sand to put the front drive shaft in. And since I bought everyone dinner yesterday, Henry's gonna put the drive shaft in for me. <laughs> yes, sir, boss. Let's do it. All right, Jesse's grabbing tools. I'm gonna grab the shaft. Although it's damaged, it'll work fine for slow off-road use. Get it off my hood here. I've been looking at it for 400 miles. So we're gonna put in our nice bent shaft. As long as we don't do 70, we're fine. Well, I mean, don't you want a Baja with all the weight? I do. <laughs> all right, let's do it. I mean, it might break a lot, but at least it comes on and off easy. Right? We did something, right? <sighs> all right, drive shaft is installed. It's a little bent, but it'll work great. Better than a uh, off-road recovery. All right, so drive shaft's in. We just found a trail we just randomly picked off the road and we're gonna see where it goes. So we actually ended up changing. It is getting hot out here. Yeah, I'm sweaty already. Yeah, it is totally getting hot and sweaty. So we decided to actually just kind of hang out here for a little bit. We might actually crack a beer here. It's like, Get off me. it's pretty secluded. <laughs> Stephanie's like loving it out here. Henry's underneath his Jeep, just looking for random problems to fix because he loves to fix things. Get off me. So uh, we're going to kick it here for a little bit and then uh, we'll do some more trailing here. Hopefully get some good shots. out of the sand tracks it was fun it really wasn't that difficult though it was kind of just two-wheel drive it was fun though yeah it was it was actually neat because you could stay in two-wheel drive you don't really need full drive we put the drive shaft in with you, you know you did need it i did it at once off the highway. Off the yeah it was it, it stepped up real steep it was it's, soft it's unique it's really cool everything's really overgrown and the trails are kind of tunnel looking they look really neat um they're soft in a lot of spots like you should have four-wheel drive with the option for yeah. Well, we're going to stock up on a couple supplies real fast at this store. 
and then uh, we're gonna go back to Ocala and kind of hang out for a little bit, and uh, we'll catch you guys there. We'll see you in Ocala. So even though we have a trash roo, I still use the uh, trash roo for all my recovery gear. But we hung this bag here at the beginning of the day. It's all of our trash, and throughout the day we keep throwing our stuff into it. And, Best uh, bags ever. It's like it's staying on there. We hasn't fallen off yet. It doesn't even move when we're driving on the no, highway no, no. or anything. So we're gonna get ready to get ready to dump this one and put a new one on there and save us a little bit of time. It keeps the garbage from being in the woods and the forest, and it keeps it uh, out of our jeeps. So it works pretty good. So we just got done doing a, a live video on Facebook. The q and A it was an hour and a half long. Sorry guys, uh, if you watch that. But uh, we're actually we're actually feeling pretty good right now. We haven't eaten all day. We had we had a couple beers. So uh, we're gonna grab some food. So we just made these these chicken alfredo things. Look how much there is. I gave half to Henry because it was too much for me. Yeah. I can eat a lot, not that much. That's two servings. We're eating good tonight. It's actually really good, though. Is I, it good? I, yeah. I, this is my first time eating, like, one of these type of MREs, and it's actually really good. Sweet. I might end this video here because it's dark. No one wants to watch dark videos. So the next video will hopefully be us heading to the Everglades. So we will catch you guys then. Thank you for watching. Like, share, subscribe. Do stuff. We'll see you guys then.